God. Wow. You gotta know what you're looking for and what you're looking at. 1500 going to watch? 1400 Paid $2,700 for that locker. Ended up getting $130,000. I paid $700 for one box and I sold it for $100,000. There's nothing in it but papers. Good eye, Daryl. Good eye. This is why I buy storage lockers. It's every man for himself. Let the best man win. All right. And now, a sneak peek at the new A&E series, Storage Wars. Today, we're in Westminster, California. This storage facility sits right on a set of railroad tracks. One side of the tracks is a bad part of town. The other side of the tracks is a good part of town. You've got a big mix of exclusive neighborhoods and working class neighborhoods. You never know what you're going to find. It's kind of like a crapshoot. One unit could be great, and the next one could be total garbage. This gives Westminster a casino-like quality. You just never know when you're going to hit the jackpot. We're in my hometown, in my backyard. We're in beautiful Westminster, California, Orange County, the most Thank beautiful God. county. Go home, man. Dave might think he's a top dog here, but if the right unit shows up, I'm going to take him out. So Brandy's tagging along with me today because she thinks I'm buying too much junk, and she thinks she can do a better job of bidding on these units. We'll see. I'm here today to kind of monitor Jared's spending and need to make sure that we get a quality locker. I'm here to do business. I'm not here to play games. These uh, past few weeks, I've been having a hell of a time just trying to keep up with the crowd, trying to get a peek inside the unit, much less find anything that I want. has been tough. So I brought my buddy Jay, who uh, I think will help me get a, a leg up on the rest of these guys. This? It's the night vision goggles. I'm gonna outfit him with night vision goggles so he can report to me what he sees in the dark. Nice. And then to help me get an eye in the sky, the stilts I brought will help us get an idea of what's in the back of the unit. I'm not sure Jay really knew what he was getting into when he woke up this morning, but uh, that's kind of a typical day with me. All right, boys, girls, we're almost ready to go. If you're almost ready to go, I'm almost ready to go, and here we go. What? He's got to be kidding. How are you feeling? Pretty good. All right. Barry has brought a little person on stilts. I don't really think that I need to say anything else about that. He may want to distract the other buyers, but his antics aren't going to work on me. I can tell here we're getting into the competition's head, so I think we're off to a good start. All right, <laughs> boys and girls, welcome to the auction today. The rules of this auction are as follows. This is a cash-only sale. When we open these gates, you're going to go in, we're going to open the door, we're going to give you five minutes to take a look around. You cannot open any boxes. As soon as you're done looking, we're going to go ahead and sell who's ever got the most cash in their pocket. And are you ready to go? Yes! yes. Let's go! All right, we're off to C-19. All right, folks, six units. This room looks like it's been ransacked. There's a tarp back there. I just see a pile of trash. It's not for me. There's a lot of boxes in there. I see some pieces of cash. Come on, dude, get out of the locker. You know, stilts and night vision goggles on the little guy, I think Barry's getting a little desperate. If you go in, we yeah, can all can. go in. Yeah, that, you're going to have to dude. pull back. A yeah. little camping gear. It's not too bad. Looks like a pretty good unit. Would I allow Jared to bid on something like this? Absolutely not. I don't know, man. It looks like a pile of trash that somebody threw in there, but you never know. My life I think my secret weapon here has stumbled onto something cool, but I gotta kind of keep it between good, us huh? girls, you know what I mean? As Jay's looking into the unit, he taps me and he says he sees something that he's sure is uh, curved glass, and, and maybe there's a large aquarium back there. Those, those are a lot of money. All right, boys, girls, if you're ready to go, I'm ready to go, and here we go. All right, we're going to sell this big old nice unit here. It looks like it's about uh, 10 by 15 or 20 foot deep, and here we go, and how much money? And I get 25 there, and I give you $50 square, and I get 50 right there. You want to go 75, sir? You reach 75, 75, 100, 100, 100, 100, Barry, you're out. 100. Got 100 bucks here. Barry and his friend keep throwing their hand up in the air. That tells me they like this unit, so I'm going to make them pay for it. 350. He's new to the game, so I'm going to drive the price up, and that's kind of a welcoming thing to the new people. So they lose money and get the hell out of the business. 
three fifty. Three and a half. Three and a half there. Seven five right there. Front of the before there. Forty four. Four fifty. They're making it easy on me. This is just fun. Yeah. Four fifty. Seven five. Front of the before there. Five hundred. You know, sort of a lot for a hunch on something he thought he saw. Yeah. I've got seven hundred. Seven seven half. Seven fifty. Seven half there. Seven seven half. Seven quarter. Seven half. Seven half. Seven fifty. Seven half there. Seven seven five. I got seven fifty. Yeah. I look over, Jay's just running away with my money here. I mean, he's just, he won't take his arm down. I'm getting a little nervous. I pushed this unit far enough. I hope he enjoys his box. Last and final call. Gotta go, guess what, Nye? So that's your way, you got it for 850 bucks. Thank you, thank everyone, 850. All right. We got it, man, we finally broke the streak, but for 850 bucks, it really wasn't that cheap. During the auction, Jay used these night vision goggles, and he swore that he saw something shiny in the back of the unit. So we took a gamble, and uh, we laid out $850, and uh, we got the unit. I don't know, man, grab this stuff off it, I'll tell you what. What is this? It's a BMW Isetta. Storage Wars premieres Wednesday, December 1st at 10 on A&E.